everybody, it's me Adele and welcome to my channel Sew for Serenity where I talk to you about my sewing journey, my love for fabrics, dressmaking and patterns and animal sewing and life chit chat. So if that sounds of interest to you, please keep on watching. Welcome back to my regular viewers and if you're new here I hope you enjoy this vlog and consider subscribing. So today's vlog is the start of my Little Miss Sew and Sew, my Guilty Pleasure subscription box. Um, all set to sew. For those of you that have watched my vlog before, you'll know that this it comes in three parts. The first part of this vlog is where I, I select my fabric and pattern choice. Uh, the second part is where I do my unboxing when it arrives. And then the third part is the grand reveal where you get to see the finished article. So hopefully you um, will stay tuned and watch that. So Little Miss So-and-So is a wonderful fabric company run by the amazing Nicola. It really, it really has so many different fabrics, not just quilting, jersey, sweatshirt, and all kinds of dressmaking fabrics at really, really good prices. It also specializes in a lot of subscription services um, and kits, um, a lot of quilting um, sets. I just like, there's so many, to name them all would be, would take me forever. So please, please check out um, the website to see what offers they've got available. Now I subscribe to the Little Miss Sew and Sew All Set to Sew um, subscription box and it is the Sew Special box is the level that I subscribe to. There is a Sew Luxurious box as well um, where you basically get exactly the same choices of pattern, choices of fabric, but the fabric is designer fabric, so that is £65 a month. The box that I subscribe to is £45 a month and you get a choice of the standard fabrics. I have put up um, on the screen the differences between the two boxes and all the details about what's in the boxes is in the notes below. The main difference with this subscription box is I've already said it, you get to choose between a stretch or a woven pattern and you also get to choose the fabric, which I think is an absolutely amazing, um, unique selling point about this box. A lot of people tell me that they get put off by subscription boxes because they don't like the idea of a complete surprise and also not all patterns suit them. Um, and also the thing about this box is that it's very size inclusive. So. Without further ado, let's go on to the selections this, this month. So as normal, I'll put up on the screen my selection process. I have the email as normal, which comes through, which tells you it's ready to select. And straight away, I go through the normal process of selecting the pattern. Now the pattern this month for woven, oh, it is Fiber Mood, Edith Top and Blouse. It's really, really nice. So it's kind of a bit of a boho slash Edwardian style to it. Um, beautiful buttons at the back and this beautiful kind of frill detail. That's really nice. I like that. Okay, that is an option. Let's have a look at the fabric choices for that. Hmm, some lovely florals, animal prints, I've looked at these before. Oh, got some Liberty's soft sateen. Oh, Liberty's cotton. Oh, that cord is nice. Be nice in a cord, wouldn't it? That is the one. Aubergine cord with little hearts on. Quite like that one. I think if I go with this pattern, I will make it in a cord that nice nice warm feel okay mental note of that one. Oh, I love a paisley yeah there's loads of liberties that's unusual oh paul smith the cotton sateen oh i like the turquoise dapper christmas collection oh Oh yeah, look at that, ball balls. <laughs> These feel a little bit more summery to me. These ones have been on for a while. Oh, that's nice as well. The glitter ochre double gauze. 
animal print. I actually have that animal print. Okay, let's have a look at the... Now let's have a look at the stretch pattern. Ooh, the Fiber Mood Leona sweatshirt. Well, that is nice. I mean, it's definitely sweatshirt season, isn't it? That is so nice. It's got such a retro. I really like the contrasting band as well. I really like that. It's like bat wings. Hmm. I think I'm going to go for a sweatshirt. Let's see what the sweatshirt fabrics are first of all before we decide. I think it's just because the weather's so cold at the moment. I just feel like I want to just wear comfy clothes. So they've got French terriers. John Loudon, oh sweatshirt in, that's nice in the wine. Oh, like the camouflage stars. Black. Mm, moss green's quite nice. Oh, dark green melange. Never seen anything like that before. That is really nice. Like a forest green, but with the melange in it. Oh, yeah, that would look lovely. It's gorgeous soft brush black sweatshirt. Mm. I really like the blouse, but I think, am I going to wear that that much? I'm probably going to get much more wear out of this jumper than I am. And I do really like this jumper pattern. Right, I think I'm going to go for that. Probably going to regret it. No, I won't regret it. It'll be fine. Right, add it to the cart. Right, so. Let's submit that order. Right, so I'm going for the green melange sweatshirting and the Leona sweatshirt. It's a proper retro 80s girl, as I always say I am. And it just is speaking to me so that's what i'm going to go for so the next time you'll see me is when the box comes it's the first of november today um that's when the email comes through i always make my selection straight away can't wait and um yeah i usually get my box around the 20th of the month so you'll, you'll see me again in about a couple of weeks for me but for you it'll be a matter of seconds so i'll see you in a minute bye hiya i'm back it's the 24th of November now and today I received my Little Miss Seven So delivery and it's a quite a hefty box this month. So without further ado, let's crack on and look at the fabric. So hopefully you can all, I can remember what I ordered. So I know I ordered the knit pattern which was a fibre mood sweatshirt and also some green melange sweatshirting I think. So let's hopefully that's what I've got. Here's my lovely little parcel. Bit of rustling. And here we go. So this is the Leona by Fibre Mood. So the instructions have been printed off. Ah, right. And the free gift is a lovely little card. How cute is that? With the sewing machine on. That'll be really nice for any sewing friends that I have that birthdays are coming up. I always like to get them sewing related cards, so it's nice to have one of those in my stash. So that can go in there. Oh, and then here is my matching thread, which is a lovely forest green colour. Beautiful. And oh, here is the fabric. Oh, it's really lovely. Look at this. So it's a forest green, but it's like got that melange effect in it, which is like a, I don't know if you call it like a grey colour. And the fabric is lovely. Oh, and it's lovely and um, fleece backed, really soft and snuggly. And also got the matching ribbon. So that's amazing. They've got the matching ribbon there as well. Um, and it's an exact match, which is perfect. So brilliant. So can't wait to get this sewn up. So yeah, the Leona by Fibre Mood is really, really nice. It's got some really interesting details. Let's have a look at the sizing. 
I think probably going to go for probably a medium I would imagine just to give me a little bit extra size don't want it to be too tight and I might even look at lengthening it a little bit as well because it does look to be quite cropped but I'll have a look at the pattern pieces so yeah that's going to be a nice hopeful quick quick make so let's go and get these in the washing machine and the next time I see you I'll hopefully be wearing it hi here I am I'm back and it's all made what do we think I'll stand up it is out. I've just spilt my tea down myself which you probably will see but please ignore that um I absolutely love this it's so retro it's unbelievable it's got a proper 80s feel to it um it's got the bat wings it's got oh I don't know this kind of boxy fit and this sweatshirt and it's just absolutely amazing so let me talk to you about it I'll insert some pictures actually first that I've took of me wearing it um, and actually, yeah, let me just um, turn around and show you the full, I don't know if you can get a good idea of it. You see, it's all gathered in here at the sleeves. Got my neck band. You can see these really, sorry if I'm, I'm touching my boobs, sorry about that. But you can see that there's this lovely sharp corner detail, which is just really interesting um, detail and technique, which I'll talk to you about in a minute. So... The Leona sweatshirt from Fiber Mood. I'm in love with this pattern. I think it's amazing. I'm so happy with it. The instructions were so, so simple to follow. Um, there is one part of the instructions that I did scratch my head a little bit over, um, but it's probably because I wasn't feeling 100% well. And I did have a look at the tutorial. There is a tutorial online which was a live sew along. I don't know if you know, but Fiber Mood tend to do these live sew alongs um, every now and again for certain popular um, patterns. And there does there is one for the Leona. So I will insert the link to the one that I followed. And the instruct the, the part of the instructions that I struggled with was just the um, part where you do the um, angle um, when you're sewing so how it basically works is you do have to um, manipulate the fabric you do have to pivot and kind of sh sew that sharp corner um, and I just wasn't quite getting it with the instructions in here so what I did was I thought let me watch the sew along watch the sew along which made me realize I had understood the instructions correctly and um, that really helped me to so sew it up now um it's really useful as well that sew along because actually what it she says in it is when you're actually putting in this sleeve so how it works is the sleeve these the front bodice pieces pieces are v and the same in the back and then you sew the sleeve um along here and obviously do some gathering and attach that in and then you have to do your pivoting to get that sharp corner now obviously usually sewing on knit fabrics you would use a zigzag stitch but it does actually say in the tutor in the tutorial online that you don't need to because of obviously it's not going to get massively stretched this you're okay with a straight stitch so I just did a, a straight stitch at a three and obviously overlocked it after I was happy with placement etc anyway um, and that made it a lot easier because it would have been really hard doing on a zigzag stitch so I do recommend you watching the tutorial on this. It's not very long um, and it just gives you that um, little bit of comfort that you're doing the right thing. Um, the thread that came in the pack was a perfect match. I luckily had some green overlocker thread as well, which was pretty similar. <coughs> and the, the ribbing that came with it was also a really good match. Although this sweatshirting is quite stretchy, I did think you maybe would have got away with it for a neckband, but obviously didn't need to. Um, the seam allowance had been printed on the pattern. I wasn't 100% sure, so I did message Nicola and ask her, and she said yes, it had been included. So that was a big relief because nobody likes having to put seam allowances on things, but I have done it before. Um, and I actually got this out of about a meter and a half of fabric um in total so we've got two and a half meters in the pack and i've actually got quite a bit of fabric left over i'll show you so i've probably got um a full half a meter well probably over a half a meter intact 
and then I've also got yeah so I've got probably just over half a meter intact it's probably even more than that about 0 0.7 intact and then I've got scraps all here but quite large scraps and then I've also got a big piece of the ribbing left as well so what I'm thinking is there I can make Alice a little sweatshirt um out of that those little scraps which is brilliant and we can be matching um so yeah again the value for money on this um I think it's really really good um because you always have a little bit of fabric left over to make another make so this fabric is still in stock on the website so it's a um green melange so it's got that kind of grayy speckled look through it and it's actually in dark green and it's 12 pound a meter and they do the, the cuffing to match they do do it in grey as well. I'm just having a look what other colours they do it in. Mm, I think they do just do it in the two colours. Um, so if you still, if you if you like this fabric and want to get some, they still have some in stock. It's really super cosy inside, but not too thick. So this is really really soft against your skin. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm wearing this today and I'm feeling really lovely and cosy. What else to say about it? It's got a one centimeter centimeter seam allowance. Um, I've just got nothing more to say really it's just I'm just really happy with it I love it um I'm gonna definitely make some more of these up I think they're really really um I think they're really really good for um something just a little bit different now I feel like this is a really nice cozy comfortable jumper but also I think it would look lovely in something a bit more elevated like you know with some nice jewelry um, a pair of jeans um or black black leather look trousers on a night out I think it could be really really nice maybe put some gems on it um oh, there's so much you can do some embroidery yeah the kind of sky is the limit i was tempted to put a patch on this i had a lovely christmas patch that i was tempted to put on but then i thought no because then you're making you can't wear it all year round so i kind of drew a line under that but yeah i'm really happy with it i love it and um for those of you that have purchased this box after watching my vlogs i'm really ha i'm really happy that you've um been inspired to buy them and, and i'd love to know how you're getting on with making them a few of you have reached out to me and said that you've purchased um, the box and are excited to get things made up so yeah i can't wait to see um your makes and if you do make one up and put it on instagram please tag me in and i can um follow you um and get to see your makes as well i hope you've liked this vlog so if you have please click the like button if you don't subscribe already please subscribe why aren't you subscribed do it now i'll wait thank you um and if you want to subscribe to this box as well then please um follow all the information below in the show notes and subscribe for your first box they're very very affordable 45 pounds a month for this box and if you want to subscribe to the luxury box it's 65 pounds a month so i hope you've enjoyed it and i'll speak to you all soon take care bye <laughs>